Hello from Kyoto. We are here. We are about to do some kimonos today. It's going to be a very interesting, fun day. We brought We're our two mates. Hey. We've got Phil and Owen. Say hello. Hey. Howdy. Hey. <laughs> right, we're going to go to Okamoto Kimono Rental. We've done this once before. It was a real good time last time we did it. And uh, yeah, let's have a good time. What are your thoughts? What do you think is going to happen today, Phil? More glitches in the system. Owen? Very, very glitchy. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're standing outside Yasaka Jinjamaya. This is the front of Yasaka. Yasaka we're not standing blah, blah, blah. outside Jinjamaya. No. That means in front. Whatever. We're standing outside Yasaka Shrine. This is the famous one that you can see from all the way down there, where many hotels are. Right, let's uh, it's Ikimasho. We're, we're on a tight schedule, we're already late. Onigiri G. Onigiri G? Onigiri o'clock. I'm choosing my obi, the belt, that goes around the kimono. This is the kimono. So I need to choose something that will match. Something in gold. I like this one. Choosing the bag. Secure the bag. Ashley has chosen to go for a kimono, a kimono. rather than a yukata. What's the difference? A kimono is more like it's like it'll be hotter because there's more layers, but much more swag. I so am on board with the swag. <laughs> Premium content. I've got my kimono about to get changed. We're not seeing that though. Not for free. Not for free. <laughs> Hashtag Japan. Hashtag like and comment and subscribe. <laughs> So we go east. <laughs> we go sheesh. We go sheesh. We're currently in the kimono shop picking out our yukatas to wear. Absolute flashes. Absolute flashes. I've gone for the kuro black. I've gone He's for, gone for the, the not so kuro. It's hot. Off. Off. Very clean. Fresh. We are now picking out belts. Look at this. That is pretty swag. That's dragons and that. Drag dragons and shit. Tigers and that. Tigers and that. That's DC. Kakoi. I look like. Swag Severus, Severus Swag, Severus, <laughs> Severus, swag. Severus Swag. This guy, I, li I like this outfit. That's actually sick. The Zeus, and, and it is Dennis in the streets, <laughs> Menace in the sheets, Menace in the sheets. <laughs> With my caban, your clutch, the clutch caban. So basically, we are in Yukatas, which is the summer version of a kimono. The Yukata is made of cotton. It's really, really light and breathable, which is good because it's about 30 degrees today. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30 degrees. That was a big range. Uh, these are the kimonos which you wear in the winter, and these are a lot heavier. I think these ones are made of polyester. YouTube on this. YouTube on this. <laughs> and our, um, how do you say, hobby? Shumi. Shumi. No, no, no pro, no pro. <laughs> pro janai. Just a hobby. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kako janai. Very comfortable. Comfortable. Breathable. Feels fresh. Feel fresh, funky. I feel, feel godlike. Does it feel tight? It does. Thank you. Thanks. Right, so we've just got our yukatas on. Here we all are. Kimono. Oh, kimono, yeah, she's gone for kimono. Look at that. Looks they cute. did my hair, which is like very impressive. I can't do your hair like that. Yeah, it looks nice. We are super hungry. It's about 12 a.m., 12 a.m., 12 p.m., about noon. We are going to get some lunch. We'll Big see you sushi. in a bit. Maybe sushi. Big sushi. It's got to be something traditional. Something traditional Japanese to match. Siberia. Size? <laughs> McDonald's. <laughs> Let's go. We are currently in the Gion, Gion part of Kyoto, which is very famous for like geishas and being very traditional. I mean, look at the architecture. 
super traditional. There's lots of rules here as well, like because it's so traditional. But like you, need you to be like, respectful. you need to. You can't take photos of the geisha. I think technically you're not actually allowed to film here, so you might get. There's a policeman right over there behind the camera. Gonna... Crep check. Crep check. Oh, shit! Look at what. Are, what are those? What are those? They're my tabbies. <laughs> oh, it's actually really hot. I'm I'm sweating, but and I'm in I'm in a yukata. Ashley, how many layers do you have? Three. Very, very, very hot. Hot. How are you feeling, Owen? Very, 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 very. And you? I'm a little damp. We didn't go to the sushi place. It was like two man, which is like twenty thousand yen for one course. Too expensive for us. Gato, one thousand for onigashima. So now we're having a beer and some soba and stuff. And this is probably a really bad angle. <laughs> so this is our first course. We've gone for inari, which are like deep, it's like tofu skin. It's a rice wrapped in sweet tofu skin with some ginger. These are the biggest ones I've ever seen. And as, as Owen just said, they look like... Soggy croissants. Itadakimasu. What have you got, Ash? This is like wild mountain vegetables over. Very delicious. <laughs> so what have you got? Ramen. What? Cold ramen. Cold noodles. We're back. We've just hopped out a cab. Lunch was delicious. We didn't go to the sushi place because it was very expensive. We went to a different place. Um, literally just opposite where we rented the kimonos from. I'll put a link in the description for where it was. It was the Okamoto Yasaka Ginger kimono rental shop. And it was literally directly opposite that. Anyway, now we are at the Heian Jingu, the Heian Shrine, which if you know anything about Japan or have been to Japan and use Japanese money, you will know that the Heian Jingu is the shrine on the 10 yen coin. On the 10 yen, get a 10 yen. We did that last time we came here. But oh, yeah, um, got ten yen in. not that bit there, it's the, the bit inside. Like what do you reckon, Phil? Well, I reckon I learned something new just now. I am very, very hot in the kimono. Kimono is usually worn in winter, but I'm wearing it here in midsummer in Japan. So it's like three layers, it's very, very, very hot indeed. You can't, you can't, you can't, darling, you can't. You you got that. You can't be serious. Wow. Comedian. Comedian. Oh. Comedian. Oh, <laughs> oh, We are here at the Heian Shrine. This shrine is very famous for being the one that is on the 10 yen coin. I've got a 10 yen coin here. I don't know if you can see, but that is that. That was actually, you could see that, that was good. Theo is here with a parasol because it is quite hot today. Um, this shrine is super nice. It's got quite a short history, but it's huge and it's super vibrant colors. Definitely recommend coming here in uh, Kyoto if you're here. We've been here before, but we've never been into the paid garden area. So we're gonna go do that today and experience Heian Shrine in all of its glory. All of its glory. So let's go to the garden. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. So we are in the gardens of Heian Jingu or Heian Shrine. They're very nice. I'm quite surprised actually. They're really nice. It's quite a big open area. It basically sort of loops around the whole of the um, 
the shrine area. It's much bigger than I thought it was going to be. Like yeah. it's, it's really big. It's taking us a long time to walk around in the kimonos with the special shoes on. There were some stepping stones. They were very dangerous. Nearly went. In Nearly the went in on multiple occasions. And now we've come across this big, big pond and this sort of like big bridge going across it up here. It's getting very major. Peaceful, apart from the apart from the cicadas, which you can definitely hear. So but yeah, loud. getting good vibes. Let's go. Another thing. It is boiling. It's like 31 degrees now. Ashley's really regretting her choice in the real kimono. We're about to get heat stroke, send help. How hot is it? Very, very. This is the longest. Hotto, hotto. About seeing a vending machine as well. Yeah, Ashley makes a good point. There is not a single vending machine in this place. I mean, it is a shrine, so you know, not to be expected, but. They are usually everywhere, vending machines, but not in here, not in the Heianjingu. So if you're coming on a hot day, bring some water. We're now off to Chionin, a very big Buddhist temple, which is about a five, 10 minute walk from Yasaka Jinja, which is the famous one we were at earlier, where we started today. And it's a very nice sort of park area. You can wander around, there's lots of places to sit down. It's Have good. a relax. Have a relax. I'm excited. Very excited. For a relax. For a, for a relax. Hi guys, we are at Chion Inn. Uh, as you can see, very big Buddhist temple with a lot of stairs. Phil, are you excited? Yeah, I'll be. <laughs> Come on, Ash, you got this. It's very hard to go up the stairs without flashing everyone. <laughs> One step at a time. Hot, sweaty, and these stairs are steep. Doesn't look like it, but they're really big stairs. You have to take. Oh, show a little leg, a little action. Show some leg, Phil. I keep standing on my The stairs are absolutely. These stairs are. Sad. <sighs> Mm mm mm. Delicious. Foolish. How would you describe it, Ash? Like icy vanilla ice cream, like cheap, cheap ice cream. But it's got like little chunks of ice in, so it's really cooling. That's why it's called Coolish. It's good because you can like put a lid back on. Maybe there is something similar to this in the UK, but I've not been there for three years, so. Well, yeah. Froob. In Asda. Frozen Froob. No, it's not a Froob. A fro Froobs are disgusting. So Coolish. When it comes out, this is really hard to squeeze with one hand. It looks sort of like this. We are here at Chion Inn. It's so big. It's so surprisingly massive. <laughs> I don't understand how they've like hidden this. So you can't see it at all from the street. This is the first time we've uh, come here and it's really surprising. Like, it's so, so large. Um, it's like 3.30 now. We're having like really nice time just walking around Kyoto in kimonos and uh, visiting places we've not been before. We have to return them at 5.30, .30. so we don't have that long left. Speaking of the kimonos and yukatas, we should probably say that they cost about 4,600 for the men's yukata rental and the women's cost. Mine was, I think total was 6,000, but I have like a full kimono and then I paid 
500 yen to have my hair done, um, which is definitely worth it because and the hair's it's really, like it's really nice look. It's very good. Spin. I couldn't do my hair like that. Um, and that was 500 yen, so like my total I think was 6,000. Also, if you have your own yukata, you can take it and they will dress you in it. Yukata. 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 Kimono. Another interesting thing about Chion Inn, it's over 850 years old. It's a really, really old temple. It's been here for a long, long time, as with a lot of the, ho a lot of the hotels, as with a lot of the shrines and temples in Kyoto, they're really old. This one is 850 years old. Unlike the one we were at earlier, the Heian Jingu, which is, uh, which is less than a few hundred years old. Huh? 1892. 18, Owen says 1892, he reckons. Could be. Same age as Liverpool Football Club. That's mad to think that. <laughs> Imagine that. Liverpool and Heian Shrine, but found, founded at the same time. Crazy this. Again, viewers, I'm giving you another chance. Who has the best outfit? Contestant number one. You've got to do like a, a vote. Philip, do like a. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hold on. You've got to do like a pose or something. Vote this guy. Let us know in the comments. Comment your favourite outfit. Hey. So it is half past four. Our feet are in dire shape. <laughs> uh, right now we are in Maruyama Park. Yeah, that's where we are. I knew that. Um, and we are about to head back to the shop to drop off our robes. So, <laughs> um, yeah, uh, we've seen some beautiful temples. If you ever get a chance to go into a Buddhist temple, I highly recommend it. It is, it is serene, it's ornate, and a sight to behold. We're in Yasaka Shrine and the place that we rent the kimonos from is actually just outside of this. So it's a good place to go get it because then you're right in with all the shrines, really good. So we're just going to walk through and uh, then go back and what's going on behind me. What do we think, chaps and lass? Very fun times. Very, very fun. Fun times? Very interesting. But Absolutely my, worth it. My feet are hurting. Feet picks. And that's it, we're done. We have just given our kimonos back to Okamoto, the shop where we rented them from. I can highly recommend them. They were really, really professional. Perfect service. They had a really wide range of stuff to choose from, even for really tall people like me. 190 centimeters. Even for really wide people. Really <laughs> short people and Americans, Americans yeah. as well. <laughs> Sizes for all and um, yeah, brilliant. What do you guys think? We'll say one word. We'll do one word each as we go around, starting with Owen. Uh, Sugoi. Special. Subscribe. Like and comment, but all one word, no spaces. <laughs> um, and yeah, we will see you again in the next video. Remember to like, comment, share and subscribe and we will see you again soon.